Welcome to FUYME TV. I'm Earl Batman Stringer, and in this video, you read the title. I'm talking about the Mayweather Pacquiao fight happened over the weekend, and your boy spent a hundred dollars on it. That's right. I actually bought this shit. And um ah, here's what I think. First of all, a lot of people talking shit about the fight. A lot of people saying it was whack, it was boring. It, some people even saying it was a it was a um it was a hoax, it was a setup, everything, you know, you know, you heard it all. Bottom line is people have points, you know, when they say it's boring or you know it could have been better and stuff like that. That's that's legit. But at the same time, if you know anything about Mayweather, anything, watch any of his fights, you know that's how he fights. His whole his whole thing is, you know, he's the best defensive fighter in the game. You see my little my little defense and shit. Mm. Uh, you know, he's known for his defense, right? He's known for not getting hit. So of course he came in to this fight not trying to get hit but keeping it real i watched the fight twice right keeping it real he did you know obviously i won't say run but you know trying to get out the way but there was times where he actually did attack pacquiao like it's watch the fight there's times where he go in and he land some some good shots on pacquiao right uh so then you got people saying Oh, it comes out now Pacquiao was hurt. He had a shoulder injury. He wanted a, a some sort of shot before the fight, and they wouldn't let him get it. Hey, hey, Pacquiao, I like you. You cool, but that's bullshit. You cannot use that shit. The Pacquiao fans can't use that. You just can't use that shit, especially with all of the shit talking before the fight and all of this stuff. You can't use my shoulder was hurt because if you won, right? If Pacquiao won, no one would say anything about a shoulder injury, right? It's a fucking fact, right? So, I mean, to be honest with you, Mayweather won that shit. I mean, what can you say? I mean, I ain't gonna lie. First, I was rooting for Pacquiao. I'm talking about when the fight first got announced, you know, Pacquiao the underdog, blah, blah, blah. But then, everybody I talked to, everybody asked me like a week before the fight, like, yo, who you think gonna win, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, you know what? It would have been nice to see Pacquiao win, but there's something about Mayweather. There's something about that dude. Every time, you know, the fight about to start, whoever he about to fight, just they don't bring it. Mayweather always adapt to the shit, man. Always. So I'm like, eh, pretty much Mayweather go win this shit. But look, another thing I realized was all the people that spent all this money and and and, and got the pay per view and went to fucking fight parties. All of that, you weren't really paying for the fight, so to speak, in my opinion. You was paying for the event, right? That hundred dollars went for the for the for the the event to say you got the fight. You understand what I'm saying? To to say you know you were part of it in some way, it would gave you a reason to throw a party and shit. That's that's what you was paying for, you know. That's the bottom line. Could the fight have been better? Yeah, but they don't give a fuck. They made over a hundred million dollars a piece. I let the chain hang. Yeah, I'm tattered up. And I love the cuss. I just don't give a fuck. See, I'm just doing me. And you should do 